it's been snowing all night and it's currently like 10 something in the morning and it hasn't stopped snowing and I absolutely love it. So right here, I attempted to make crackers, homemade crackers, and they turned out okay. Not what I expected, but it's pretty much the same bread recipe that I have done, and you just flatten them out. I added everything bagel seasoning, which helped with the flavor, and they did turn out good. Like, I ate them, but they weren't super crispy, which is what I was hoping for, but it's a pretty simple recipe. I still need to practice to get better at it, but... This is my cracker making <laughs> attempt. And then I had some breakfast. These are not the crackers, this is toast that I made. But it was really good, just a simple breakfast. Brute. Right now I'm sitting in this little half igloo. Here's a little bench right here of snow. The kids here probably built it. Super cute. They did pretty good. Right here is the France sign and then the France pool and they line up right against the river with the mountains in the background which is just incredible but Glenwood Springs was really cool me and Josh loved it there's so many different pools to try and they all have different mineral mineral contents of the original like water spring in the actual area that it's imitating so we thought it was really fun it wasn't super crowded it was kind of crowded but not crazy we had drinks and i loved trying all the different pools i know he did too so it's really cool to experience because you can really feel it in your body like feel the different minerals and the salts and the everything <laughs> so that was really cool and they had showers at the facilities so you could shower after being in the water all day and it was super cool so, and this is hotel colorado and Honestly, it was really, really pretty. It was very historical and old and fun looking through everything. They had really pretty fireplaces and we ate at this little restaurant. It was booty. <laughs> it was not very good. Um, so just keep that in mind if you end up trying it, but it was a cozy hotel and it was definitely cool to go experience and see. But yeah, it was definitely not the greatest food, <laughs> but it was a cool experience. So.
We are headed to Beaver Creek today. It's our first time going there. We're about to stop and get some lunch and coffee and then take the drive there. We're going to Butterhorn Bakery again. <laughs> That's like our favorite spot here. It's convenient and it's really good. Um, but we slept in today um, because we stayed up late and we're headed to Beaver Creek. right here this jeep parked right here and i had to squeeze through that empty space Look at those mountains. 
They're so visible today. Here's Brutus. So pretty. <laughs> when this is your freezer, <laughs> I think it's your hand doing it. No, me proud of my work. Where's my hand? You want it? I just went to my last Pilates class here. It also snowed yesterday, so there's a lot of. Fresh snow, it's so pretty. We're just walking back to the truck now. And then gonna go home and probably rest for a little bit. So I just made our last dinner that we're eating in Breckenridge, Colorado. It is baked chicken with pasta like a chicken alfredo of sorts. But we're about to eat dinner. Josh is getting all of the air skirts deflated underneath the trailer so we can pack those. And then we have packing for the next two days ahead of us before we head out Wednesday, so. But right now I'm about to go watch Timeless and eat dinner. So it is Tuesday night and we are currently getting everything ready to head home. We're in Colorado and we are driving all the way to Florida over the next couple days, so. We're just getting everything packed away. I'm in the bathroom right now in the Airstream and I'm wiping up Brutus's area so that we can put stuff on the floor in here. So, but we are leaving tomorrow in the morning. So tonight's just a work night. <laughs> we just have a lot of stuff to do, but I'll kind of show you the journey of going home in an Airstream because it's stressful. <laughs> but anyway, that's just not good. So we are getting ready to leave. It's the morning that we leave and I am making sandwiches for us. I just ran to the store to get us bread because the bread that we had yesterday sucked. <laughs> it was a gluten free and it just cracked. But I'll kind of show you the process of making the sandwiches. This is kind of what we're going to be eating for the next few days while we're driving so we don't have to eat gas station food primarily. So anyway, that's what I'm doing and this is just something we've done recently. It's okay. This is the Airstream completely cleaned up and ready for us to drive all the way to Florida. We just put everything away in their places, fill the sink up with valuables, stuff that can break, and pretty much get ready to go. The bathroom, we put our monitors, and that's about it. This was our last little walk with Brutus before we left.
just slept for like a couple hours. I was on work, but we slept for a little bit and parked at a Cracker Barrel <laughs> and I just ran in and got us some coffees. It's raining here, but anyway, that's just an update. We're almost home. It is Friday, so that's just the update. Brody's.